Looks like the samurai wants a word with us. Fume. Tenzo. You both look well. Feeling better with the eagle gone. Nice work, by the way. <laughs> Same to you. The Eagle Tribe will lose their foothold here, if we keep fighting. Hear that, Fune? He said we. Find me later, Sakai. I could use the help of a samurai who knows how to keep a secret. Looks like you're healing up. It only hurts when I laugh, so... I should be fine around you. <laughs> you only laugh at your own jokes anyway. <laughs> but I'll never swing a blade like I used to. No more robbing innocent merchants on the high seas. How will you make yourself useful? Too many people here still suffer from the eagle's poison. There's no cure, but I can ease their pain. Maybe even help some recover, like you. The eagle's medicine forced me to relive my father's death. Gave me another chance to avenge him. What did you do? I realized what I feared more than dying. Failing my father. For years, I blamed myself for his death, and for choosing to live. So I forgave myself, and him. And that cured you? The darkness never leaves completely, but it recedes. Maybe that's how to heal the others. Guide them through the memories, help them face their fears. I hope you're right. Years ago, I could never have imagined saying this, but I'm glad we met, Tenzo. Never thought I'd do this either. Thank you, Jin. I better head out soon. See if I can find more of the Eagle's victims. And get them the help they need.
Sounds like you could use a hand. What are you doing? Mongols torched my home. Either I build a new house, or I sleep in the grass. You don't have any help? Any family? I don't have anyone. Lost my parents some 15 years ago. Always had to rely on myself. And now I have to do it with nothing to my name. Ah, don't look at me like that. Everyone has a story. Mine is I don't think I have enough wood. I might be able to help with that. Are you sure? Never mind. I'll take it. I'm building a house. Let's hope the Mongols don't burn this one down too. I may be able to help with that as well. I look forward to seeing your handiwork. Oh, I'm not building it here. Still gathering supplies. But thank you. I'll take this back to the site. <laughs> Can't believe I'm doing this. seen what the Eagle Trad can do. And you're too young to remember the samurai invasion, the pain we endured, the people we lost. Thought I knew every face on Iki. Just a traveler. Stranded here by the Eagle tribe. You're welcome to join us. If you want to hear an old man complain about the past. We survived one invasion, and we can do it again. Or have you all forgotten how much we suffered at the hands of the samurai? That was nothing compared to the danger we face now. Nonsense. You are too young to know anyway. It's past time. I remind you all about the dark days of the samurai invasion. About the brutality of Kazumasa Sakai. Fifteen years ago, our home was invaded by an army of ruthless samurai. Their leader was Kazumasa Sakai, the butcher of Iki. He rode to battle atop his demonic beast, shielding with armor as black as his master's heart. Luckily, the butcher made a grave mistake when he came to Iki. He brought his whelp of a son. Our bravest warriors hunted the boy, not to kill, but to tempt his bloodthirsty father. Kazumasa gave chase and rode into a trap. His armored horse met a grisly end. But the butcher and his runt son survived, then fled like 
Cowards! Enough of these lies! That is not what happened. I lived near Senjo Gorge. I saw it with my own eyes. So did I. Who are you? My name is Jin Sakai. Kazumasa Sakai was my father. He gave his life trying to help this island. Help! He murdered us! Your people repaid his help by murdering him. Is that why you're here? To avenge your father and take my head? You may be a liar, but you are not my enemy. Not yet. Stop this! You're acting like wild dogs! I came here to help, not for revenge. You mentioned my father's horse armor. After he died, we never recovered it. We know. Tell me where it is, and I can use it to ride against the Eagle tribe. I would die before I help a samurai. It's time you leave. something about my father's horse armor, but he'll never tell me. Unless I listen in on him, without being seen. Stay out! about noble samurai, and I would have... Jiro. I lost six family members to the samurai invasion. My sister was still a child. The way they were butchered, we couldn't recover everything to give them a proper burial. <sighs> that never should have happened. What about the rest of your story? Ah, yes. I was just getting to the good part. Kazumasa fell for our trap and lost his armored horse. As our warriors closed in, the butcher and his boy fled into Senjo Gorge. The samurai limped through the canyon and ran headfirst into an ambush. There was no grand battle. Only a few raiders with dull blades, but that was all it took. One swing to end the life of Kazumasa Sakai. While the samurai slunk home, we recovered the armor from Kazumasa's mount. Over the years, our finest horses wore that armor. Every one of them killed its rider. As if possessed by the butcher's vengeful spirit. So we sold his horse's armor to the Ida merchant family. The cursed armor left our shores aboard the merchant fleet as a storm descended on our island. The sky roared with the thunder of a thousand charging samurai, and the raging tempest shattered the Ida ships against our rocky coastline. The ruins of that doomed fleet still choke Zasho Bay. And somewhere in that watery graveyard lies the cursed armor once worn by the horse of Kazumasa Sakai. My father's horse armor is still lost in Zasho Bay. Armor should be on the merchant's lead ship, marked by the Ida family banner. Was it gold or red?
Banners of either family. Father's horse armor. We'll see if it fits Noble. So 
you well, Noble. Curse or not, you wouldn't throw me, would you, boy? You look just like my father's horse. May this armor protect you in battle. The evil tribe. They found the survivors' camp. Come, Nobu. Armor of Kazuma Sasakai, restored to his son, and cursed no more. After everything I said, you saved us. There is a new threat on Iki. I saved you from these Mongols because I was raised to help those in need. Raised by Lord Shimura, and the man you call Butcher. I can't forgive your father. But as for his son... You're more merciful than he ever was. I never thought I would say this, but... Thank you, Lord Sakai. You're a good horse, Noble. 